it's hard to convince people that it is possible to fix a sidewall, but getting that stamp of approval from SEMA is just invaluable for us. My name is Andy, and I started Glue Tread with my dad, Dave, in 2018. The biggest problem that we were looking to solve was, was sidewall repair. Obviously, there had been no innovation within tire repair at all for several years before this, and when we had a hole in the sidewall of our ATV tire, it was kind of hard to believe that there was no way to fix this. The sidewall of a tire is different than the treaded area, right? It needs to be more flexible, but it also gets quite a bit of damage. I mean, as you're going down thin trails in any off-road setting, you have rocks and sticks and things like that that are hitting the sidewall of that tire, and, and there hasn't been any way to fix it in the past. I mean, people have used plugs, but as you put a plug into a slice in the sidewall of the tire, the slice just continues to get bigger. When you put the adhesive onto the tire, there's actually like a chemical weld that happens. And you can see this when you use the patch. So in order to put a patch on the tire, you need to sand down the area around the damage, um, apply the adhesive, and then apply the patch. When the adhesive goes onto the rubber, it actually makes a chemical weld between the two pieces of rubber. And that bond is stronger than the rubber itself. And that's shown in a lot of our testing when, when we glue two pieces of rubber together and pull them apart, the rubber breaks before the bond fails. In 2021, I went to SEMA for the first time and I was honestly blown away by the sheer size of it and just how well everything was put on. I mean, all the machines and vehicles there were just, just beautiful and really well done. And I think there were a lot of great ideas and really impressive entrepreneurs there. And after seeing that, I realized that this is somewhere that Glue Tread definitely needed to have a presence. And while I was at that show, I really decided I'm going to do whatever we can to get into this show um, for 2022. We ended Launchpad because we thought it was such a perfect fit for Glue Tread. We're at a stage in the company where a stamp of approval and the financial reward of being a part of this competition is just huge. I mean, it's hard to convince people that it is possible to fix a sidewall, but getting that stamp of approval from SEMA is just something that's um, invaluable for us. Winning Launchpad would be huge for us. I'm always thinking about how we continue to improve the product, um, how we can grow the business. I think winning SEMA would help, you know, help us grow both financially, but also um, in the growth of the business and acceptance of sidewall repair in the industry. This is another tool in the kit to help you be self-reliant when you're in a remote place.